Hermann Hesse, the celebrated German-Swiss writer, is renowned for his exploration of the human psyche, spirituality, and the search for meaning. His novels, such as Siddhartha, Steppenwolf, and The Glass Bead Game, offer profound insights into the nature of self-discovery, creativity, and personal fulfillment. These themes are intricately connected, and Hesse's works provide valuable lessons on embracing one's creative potential and fostering personal growth. 1. The Journey of Self-Discovery and Creativity At the heart of Hesse's philosophy is the notion of self-discovery as a central theme in personal growth. In Siddhartha, the protagonist's journey is emblematic of the quest for self-understanding. Siddhartha's path to enlightenment is not defined by adherence to specific teachings but by his personal experiences and insights. This journey underscores the idea that true creativity and self-expression emerge from within, rather than from external validation or conformity. Self-discovery involves exploring one's passions, talents, and inner desires. Hesse illustrates that creativity is an organic process, flourishing when one is attuned to their own inner rhythms and truths. Siddhartha's journey emphasizes that personal creativity is not just about artistic endeavors but about finding and living one's authentic self. 2. Embracing the duality of human nature. Hesse's exploration of duality is particularly evident in Steppenwolf. The protagonist, Harry Holler, represents the tension between his civilized self and his wild, primal instincts. Holler's internal conflict reflects the broader human struggle to reconcile different facets of one's personality. Creativity often emerges from this tension. Hesse suggests that embracing and integrating these opposing aspects of ourselves can lead to a more profound and authentic creative expression. By acknowledging and reconciling our inner contradictions, we open ourselves to a richer, more diverse creative life. For Holler, and for readers, accepting the complexity of human nature can lead to greater personal insight and innovative thinking. 3. The Role of Solitude in Creative Development Solitude is a recurring motif in Hesse's works, particularly in Siddhartha and Steppenwolf. Hesse portrays solitude not as loneliness but as a space for introspection and self-discovery. For Siddhartha, solitude is essential for spiritual growth and understanding. It allows him to connect deeply with his own thoughts and experiences, free from external distractions. In creative pursuits, solitude provides the necessary environment for reflection and innovation. It is in moments of quiet and isolation that individuals can tap into their deepest thoughts and ideas. Hesse's portrayal of solitude highlights its role as a catalyst for creativity. By retreating from the noise of everyday life, individuals can access their inner reservoirs of creativity and insight. 4. Spirituality Beyond Conventional Boundaries Hesse's works often transcend traditional religious and spiritual boundaries, advocating for a universal spirituality that is more personal and individualized. In Siddhartha, the protagonist's spiritual journey moves beyond the confines of established religions, exploring various philosophies and practices to find his own path. This approach suggests that creativity and spiritual growth are deeply interconnected. By transcending rigid doctrines and embracing a more fluid understanding of spirituality, individuals can foster a more profound and personal form of creativity. Hesse implies that a creative life is one that integrates personal spiritual experiences and insights, rather than conforming to external expectations. 5. The Significance of Art and Intellectual Pursuits In the Glass Bead Game, Hesse presents a vision of a society where intellectual and artistic pursuits are central to human existence. The protagonist, Joseph Connect, navigates a world where the glass bead game represents the synthesis of art, science, and spirituality. This game symbolizes the integration of various aspects of human knowledge and creativity. 
Hess's depiction of the glass bead game underscores the importance of intellectual and artistic engagement in achieving a fulfilling life. Creativity, in this context, is not limited to traditional forms of art but encompasses a holistic approach to understanding and synthesizing diverse fields of knowledge. Hesse suggests that a meaningful life involves the pursuit of intellectual and artistic excellence, where creativity flourishes through the integration of different disciplines. 6. Accepting and Embracing Change Change is a constant theme in Hesse's novels. Characters like Siddhartha and Harry Holler undergo significant transformations throughout their journeys. Hesse's exploration of change emphasizes its inevitability and its role in personal growth. Creativity is often a response to change. Hesse teaches that accepting and embracing change is crucial for personal development and creative expression. By adapting to new circumstances and being open to evolving ideas, individuals can enhance their creative potential. Hesse's characters demonstrate that resilience and flexibility are essential for navigating the ever-changing landscape of life and creativity. 7. The Quest for Wholeness and Integration A recurring theme in Hesse's work is the quest for wholeness. In Steppenwolf, Harry Holler's struggle is ultimately one of integrating the disparate parts of his personality into a cohesive whole. This quest for integration is also evident in the glass bead game, where the synthesis of different aspects of human knowledge and experience represents a form of completeness. Hesse's emphasis on wholeness reflects the idea that creativity emerges from the integration of various aspects of the self. By reconciling different facets of our personalities and experiences, we can achieve a more complete and authentic form of creative expression. Hesse encourages readers to seek balance and unity in their lives, fostering a deeper and more meaningful connection to their creative endeavors. Conclusion Hermann Hesse's writings offer rich and nuanced lessons on creativity, self-discovery, and personal growth. His exploration of themes such as the journey of self-discovery, the duality of human nature, the role of solitude, and the significance of spirituality provides valuable insights into the nature of creativity and the human experience. By embracing these lessons, individuals can cultivate a more profound and authentic creative life, characterized by integration, adaptability, and personal fulfillment. Hesse's works remind us that creativity is not a static quality but a dynamic process of continual growth and exploration. Through his characters and narratives, Hesse invites readers to embark on their own journeys of self-discovery, to embrace their inner contradictions, and to find inspiration in both solitude and change. In doing so, he offers a timeless framework for understanding and nurturing the creative human spirit. This detailed exploration of Hermann Hesse's life lessons should provide a comprehensive understanding of how his philosophical and literary contributions relate to creativity and personal development.